We are happy to announce that our longest uh, cat residents, Gwen and Ichabod, got adopted. Um, and because they left, the kitty cabana was kind of empty, so we added um, Aiden to the kitty cabana along with um, Wizard, who was on our show last week. Those guys are now roaming free in there and hanging out. Um, Aiden came to us as a stray. She's about three to four years old. She's a beautiful black domestic short hair. Her fur is super soft. Um, she's just a lovely cat and she's really starting to blossom in the kitty cabana. Previously, when she was in her cage, she seemed kind of shy. She just kind of hung out in her hammock and um, didn't really come out very often. If someone stopped to visit her, she enjoyed the attention and the affection, but she didn't really ask for it. Now in the kitty cabana, um, you're really getting a, a, a fuller glimpse at, at who she is as a cat. Um, when someone comes in, she comes to the door. Um, I found her the other day you know, in her bed and I kind of looked in to see if she was in there. And as soon as she saw me, she came out, she wanted attention. Um, she's also become quite the lap cat. Um, she'll jump up on your lap and um, you can pick her up and put her on your lap. She's very happy to have visitors. Um, she hasn't been into so much a lot of play lately, but just into all of the attention and affection. So um, it just goes to show that um, the animal's personalities can change when they have more space and they're not confined to that cage. So you wanna think about that anytime you're taking any of our animals home. Um, as they have more space um, and as they get more comfortable, they're gonna change a little bit, um, but um, their personalities for an older cat, um, one that's more established like Aiden, will kind of be relatively the same. Her love for affection didn't change. She was just more outgoing now that she's not confined to that smaller cage. Um, she has already been spayed. She's been rabies vaccinated, had a, a couple of distemper vaccines. Um, we've microchipped her already. She's um, had flea and tick preventative, um, which is why she kind of has a calic today. She got some, a new dose. Um, and then we, we do worm all the animals. So again, it's a great uh, a price that you're, that you're getting these animals for. Um, it covers you know, all of that initial veterinary care. And we also offer you a free well visit to the vet.